Hello, how do you know what you want to delegate or need to delegate within your business? That's the topic of this week's video. I'm going to give you a couple of tips on how to find out and what to do about that. All right. My name is Tineke Rense from Powerful Business Academy. I help business women to scale and grow their business and double their income within a year, guaranteed. Now, what about choosing what to delegate within your business? First of all, I'm a firm believer of delegating whatever you can in your business. You should only be working with your clients. All the rest you shouldn't do. That's how I work within my business. I have a team of six people and they do various things. Now, I'm not saying you should start with that, but at least start with delegating and outsourcing, okay? Now, what tasks can you start to delegate? Tip number one, the things that you don't like doing. It's very important that you always love what you do because then you are in creation mode. Then you are in the vibe, in the zone, in flow, whatever you call it. That's when things start to move towards you. So do what you like, which means don't do the things you don't like. That's tip number one. Tip number two, don't do the things that you're not good at. And usually those are also the things you don't like, but maybe you do like to work on your website, but hey, if you're not a web designer and a web builder, you shouldn't do that. You should have someone doing that for you. Tip number three, stop doing the things that are not making you money. You should only be doing the things that are making you money. And now you might think, yeah, but if I'm on social media, that's going to make me money. Is it? If your answer is yes, okay, then you should do it. If your answer is, I hope so, that's where you're not, where, where I'm not sure if you should continue doing it. You either don't have the right strategy or it's not the right place for you to be to make your money. So I know many women lose a lot of time on social media. I do spend time on my social media, but the only thing I do is comment and engage. My team does the rest. So I don't post, I don't create the posts, I don't uh, create the, the copy, the designs. I don't, I don't do that. Why should I? There are other people who are better at that. All right. And tip number four, the things that are easy. When things are easy for you, they are most likely easy for other people. Now we could argue here, of course, you could say I've been doing this for 20 years and that, therefore it's easy. Okay. I'm not talking about those things, but I dare to challenge you. There's a lot more things that you can outsource than you believe. All the clients I work with, I have to convince them that this is not what you need to do. And they think, yeah, but I need to do my email. I need to write my own blogs, but I need to do this. I need to do that. There's so much that you don't need to do, but you believe you have to, and therefore you need to. That's the vicious circle. So I always love to challenge my clients about that. Now I am wondering if I can challenge you. Are you open to have a short conversation with me? Just a 15 minute call. When you have a business to business, service oriented business, so you offer a service to other businesses, I can guarantee you that I can double your income within a year. Now, how am I so sure? Because that's what I'm doing all the time with my clients. And just to know 100% sure that's what a 15 minute call is for. So I can ask you some questions and you can check me out. You know, we might not like each other. That's totally possible. I always want to love working with my clients and I do. I love to work with every client I have, but I don't work with everybody and you don't want to work with everybody. Fair enough. So underneath this video is a quick, uh, is a link to my calendar. You can schedule a 15 minute call with me and I guarantee you it will be valuable for you too. You will learn from it and I will not be selling you anything during this call. 
So I hope you have liked this uh, video and liked this content. Go to my YouTube channel, Powerful Business Academy, and that's where you will see all the weekly videos with different topics for business women on how to scale and grow your business. There's hundreds of topics that you need to know about when you run a business, isn't it, ladies? Okay, see you hopefully next week. Bye-bye for now.